Today, you'll see 10 ocean discoveries that even scientists don't understand. They are baffled and might remain a mystery for the end of our lives. Who knows what else is lying deep down at the very bottom of the sea? Number 10. Bacteria gathering in tremendous numbers to create a milky phenomena. For hundreds of years, generations of sailors have told tales of a mysterious event that takes place far out in the open ocean. They've described suddenly coming upon miles and miles of pale milky glowing waters, sometimes occupying the sea throughout the horizon until the eye can't see. Without any legitimate explanation for this strange phenomenon, most people dismiss the Milky Sea's accounts as tall tales or merely figments of delirious, land-starved sailors' imaginations. It wasn't until 2006 that scientists could capture a satellite image of this mysterious glow in the water. Several years later, it concluded that the light was coming from bioluminescent bacteria. However, scientists are still uncertain how or why the bacteria gather in such huge numbers and why they continuously glow as if they want to be seen from miles away. Are they trying to transform into one giant bacteria? Number 9. A Curious Purple Orb This tiny and mesmerizing blob was found at the bottom of California's ocean floor and given the official name Blobus purpleus. At first, explorers believed this strange blob was a spider sack or small octopus. However, research is still ongoing as to what it is precisely. An alien hidden in a purple rock? Some unknown animal? Researchers observed the organism from a camera on their remotely operated underwater vehicle, which was initially there to study coral. Too scared to touch it in person? They concluded that the glowing orb is a marine invertebrate called a tunicate, or some egg sac containing an embryo. I'm stumped. I have no idea. I can't even hazard a guess, one of the researchers admits to his amazement while other researchers believe it's a type of snail. No aliens, after all. Number 8. An immortal jellyfish that can cure diseases It's believed that there's no living thing on Earth that can be immortal. Live as long as you want? Sounds great, but impossible. Well, is it? One particular organism, given the nickname immortal jellyfish for its ability to revert to a polyp stage when it's hungry or in danger in escaping death, like that's not already awesome, researchers believe this jellyfish may cure cancer. Scientists are still unsure how this jellyfish can transform itself back into a juvenile polyp state and how its cells can hit the reset button. Number 7. The Bermuda Triangle is an ongoing mystery Oh, Bermuda, the mystery each of us heard of since childhood. The infamous triangle lies between Bermuda, Miami, and Puerto Rico. It is a mysterious region where planes and ships have faded and disappeared without a trace. Although there isn't any evidence that some supernatural phenomenon is going on on the island, researchers believe that natural occurrences like hurricanes and weather changes could explain these disappearances. However, it's still all up for debate. Hundreds of accidents caused only by weather problems? There were many rumors of seeing supernatural activity in the region, like UFOs and ghost ships, so who knows for sure? Number 6. The Mariana Trench was visited by only three explorers While thousands of climbers have fortunately scaled Mount Everest, the highest point on Earth, only three people have settled to the planet's deepest point. Yes, we're talking about the Challenger Deep and the Pacific Ocean's Mariana Trench. The Mariana Trench is part of a global network of deep troughs that cut across the ocean floor. They form when two tectonic plates collide. At the collision point, one of the plates dives beneath the other into the Earth's mantle, creating an ocean trench. Explorers will find themselves in the full shade as they continue to guess what else lives in the deepest parts of the Earth and how marine life can survive there. The maximum known depth of the trench is 10,984 meters. We've actually got a special video about the creatures from the deepest part of the planet, so you should check it out later. Number 5. An old ancient mystery off the coast of Japan confuses scientists. One of Japan's biggest mysteries lies in its ocean off the south coast of the Ryukyu Island and has been named Japan's Atlantis. Researchers discovered a whole underwater complex. What's more intriguing is they're unsure whether it was human-made or a natural underwater formation. Some people say the Yonaguni complex is what's left of a legendary Pacific civilization named Mu. 
Until our days, no one is quite sure what the Yanaguni Monument is or where it came from. Still, there are plenty of logical theories about the structure. Also, there's ample evidence that the complex is human-made. Some of the rock's details look too exact and too accurate for natural methods, like a trench that features two 90-degree angles plus two megaliths with straight edges and sharp corners, while erosion usually leads to softened and curved edges. And when's the last time anyone's seen a perfectly square rock? There will be more research done to determine what the true origins are. But we're counting on the legendary Mu civilization. Maybe that's the actual Atlantis city finally found. Number 4. A River Flows at the Bottom of the Black Sea Ready for a story about Lethe? No, we're not going into hell, yet! There's a river flowing at the bottom of the Black Sea. It's even complete with trees, leaves, and waterfalls. That's one of the most intriguing aspects of the ocean since it was founded. It's estimated that being on land, the underwater river would be the world's sixth largest in terms of volume of water flowing within it. Researchers working in the Black Sea have found water flows 350 times greater than the River Thames flowing on the seabed, carving out channels much like a river on the land. Forget the Amazon, this one would be even more entertaining to visit. Number 3. Unexplained Sounds Made by Creatures or Icebergs Initially recorded in 1997 in the South Pacific, an odd bloop sound makes many people wake up at night. The mystery is, no one knows the exact source of the sound. Some believe an underwater creature was lurking in the waters. What is the creature? The bloop was so loud that researchers suppose the creature should have been of enormous size. Lovecraft fans, you hear? Later, they announced that the odd noise was merely icebergs breaking off glaciers. However, many conspiracy theorists didn't accept this answer. And they've got a reason for that. What kind of iceberg can bloop like a living creature? Number 2. We know nothing about the largest animal on Earth. We all know the animal, saw its pictures in our science books, but we still don't know much about them. Sadly, because the blue whale is near extinction, all thanks to whaling trade hunting and slowing reproduction rates. So surprisingly, we know almost nothing about the most popular yet rare animal on Earth. The blue whale is immense and can range in length from 80 to 100 feet. These beautiful creatures are also timid, making it hard for researchers to learn more about them. Number 1. Mermaid-like creatures Honestly speaking, we're not sure whether this one is true or not. Keep in mind that this story comes from Russian fishermen. They can be pretty loaded sometimes, so who knows for sure if they're telling the truth. Fisherman Ilya Nogatov was surprised when his mates caught a strange creature from the Sea of Azov. I've never seen anything like it in my life, he said. It seems like the fellas fished out some semblance of a mermaid, but didn't show any signs of life. Eyewitnesses of the incident depicted the sea monster as a two-meter creature endowed with a catfish head, male torso, arms, and tail. So far, almost nothing is known about what kind of fish it is. Some biologists have declared that it may even be a totally different biological being. We're still doing a lot of research, says one of the leading biologists of the case. The cause of death of this creature could be a powerful storm. In folklore, a mermaid is an aquatic monster with the head and upper body of a female human and a fish's tail. Mermaids appear in many cultures' folklore, including the Near East, Europe, Asia, and Africa. The male mermaid, like in our case, is actually called a merman. Sounds like the next Marvel movie, right? Although mermen traditions and sightings are less common than those of mermaids, they are generally assumed to coexist with their female counterparts.